morning <coughs> and good day. Oh, an, an epic adventure awaits. Now I'm just about to leave, and look when I do a bit, of, when I do a bit of wild camping, I don't even leave a footprint. Off to Salzburg, as close as I can get. So we're going through the Alps. Good morning. It is 7:26. I've been on the road for 10 minutes. The mileage is 3944.1 <laughs> Excuse me I am off, my first destination on stop or the road I am upon right now Ah, I don't know if I just missed a turn in for Uda Right there, oh man Did I? Ah, oh, I'm sure that there was a saying Udine Ah oh man, that's where I'm going, Udine, on the SP463, and I just missed a turning for it right there. Ah, <laughs> oh, what a pain, so I've got to do a Yui. I'm sure I can do a Yui. Great start to the day, eh? So I pulled over as much as I can, all these cars are up my chuff, none of them got the balls to overtake. What I need to do, a three point turn which, oh man, uh, go on, <laughs> I need them to overtake, I cannot believe I now missed my turn, the one turn I needed to make on the right, uh, if only I'd have waited a few more moments to put the camera on, now this is going to be difficult, it's a straight road, there's no, there's a massive U-bend coming up, I really don't know what to do, difficult moment, so I'll leave the camera on, it might just, one vehicle coming. We've got a couple coming that way. They even want to give way. Oh, I've done it. <laughs> Don't toot you all, mate. <laughs> Whew, we all make mistakes. <laughs> I'm now going back to get onto the SP463 to Udine as I then head towards the Alps. Final destination. Well, en route to Salzburg. So let's see how we go. Right, I need to concentrate. <laughs> oh, look. <coughs> they are looming all around me. Ah, <laughs> SS13 is the road I want to keep on to take me to Austria. Hopefully. Signposts every now and then says Austria. I've just come through Udine, Udine. I'm sticking to this right hand section. <sighs> There's a mountain to there to my right, aren't they? So, <laughs> uh -huh. I'm not taking that road to Ribis. No. So I'm going this way. The SS13 towards their mills in front of me. Them little lumps, look. <laughs> oh, I have got more signs here, so where am I going from here? Oh man, don't know, I'm going straight. I'm heading straight to the Alps. It's got to be Austria on the other side there somewhere. So that's the way I'm going, straight. Unless I see another sign. No, it's S13, this is me, right. Wow! The excitement builds. So I do need to pull over and have a wet. <laughs> How am I going to get up them? How am I going to get over there? No idea. We'll find out when we get there. It is 9.35. And <laughs> the mileage count just hit 4,000. Right now, 4,000 miles on this epic journey as I have not gone up any mountains no I'm kind of surrounded by them oh man I'm now going whoa okay <laughs> through this Ickle tunnel well I now look like I might at some point start climbing these hills the car I ain't getting out and climbing these hills no I am absolutely surrounded by mountains I'm about 60 kilometers away from Austria and at some point 
I think, well, I should be going up in these mountains. It's like I'm skating around the edges of them. Which is, you know, I don't really want to be doing. I want to cut through them. I do. But it's just like, I don't know, it is what it is. I'm enjoying the journey. And that, it's nice. But at some point, well, I expect this to be a white knuckle ride. But I am like I say, I'm just skating around the foot of them. But they're everywhere. They are. Everywhere I look, there we go, Austria on the SS13. That's the road I'm just sticking on. And hopefully, wow, beautiful train line going through a tunnel. So to the right of me, so I think any second now when I go around here, I'll let it go through a big old tunnel. I don't mind the tunnels. Uh, I really don't. Wow, man. Oh, I've got Mr. Turn in there. No, no, this is me coming up. That's the train line going along there. Bike boys all coming out there. Wow, they're going to be on an epic journey, just like me. Right, I'll see you. Oh mate, let me start climbing. These boys, I don't know. I'll leave the camera on because these boys look like I don't know. I could be taking a few risks. There you go, round that bit. Whoa, is a car coming? Whoa, whoa, <laughs> nip one by one. Wow. Okay. Dried up riverbed to my right. And the mountains are looming. Look, they're getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Beautiful road, man. Wow, okay. Got rock. This is awesome. This really is. I'll leave the camera on for a little bit. Just so you can see what a wonderful journey this is. Cool road. The road has improved quite somewhat. The driving, well, no one's up the chuff. There's a couple of vehicles behind me. It is lovely. Train line now to the right. This is awesome. I am going to be enjoying this drive. Even if it's a bit white knuckle. I can see a massive bridge ahead. Which looks like a castle on the right. Whoa. Oh man. And now I'm still lowlands right there. Beautiful day. This is Dogna, by the way. Oh, it is awesome listening to Wait a Minute by James Taylor Quartet. Cool, smooth road. Somebody up me chuff. <laughs> no longer up me chuff. He had to come through. But it is awesome. I've been through a big old tunnel. I think I'm about to go through another one. I think it's really strange. I'm going through the Alps and I haven't been up ill yet. No, Dogna, not Dogma with an M, not an M, mama, mama. but it is also a lovely, beautiful stream running turquoise cloudy water to my right, oh, but below me, oh hang on, oh man, <laughs> I don't know if you can see it on the cam, it's like, oh it's beautiful, all I want to do is, oh mate, I want to go proper wild, I want to get in it and have a wild, 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 wild bath in the river but there's no roads down to it no unfortunately but wicked am I now gonna go into a tunnel I must do I've been up no we're, we're still we're still here oh that water does look superb down to me right oh it does and that's me out, coming out of dog now oh going a bit quick there Mr King 50 mile an hour. I did fill up with gas before I came out um, onto the main road. I thought it'd be a good idea as I saw a lady attendant and I thought that's wicked, that'll do me so I can fill up. Look at that. Oh, I'm glad I'm not going that. Oh man, that was what I was thinking going up those roads, but this road that uh, uh, GPS has led, not just by the road signs, the SS 13, that is awesome. I'm enjoying it. I'm not white knuckle riding it. It's just, it's just nice. <laughs> That'll be great on one of them bikes, wouldn't it? On these smooth roads, going under these great big bridges. 
I mean, is there a road there to there? Oh, that could, oh man, could have been too quick. Right, I am so enjoying the day. Ah, oh, quick stop, 10.15 it is. And I have been enjoying this wonderful epic journey through these mountainous ranges. And I've been keeping my eyes open to see if there's anything. Mate, oh, I don't know if it's open. Ah, I just, I thought I'd have a quick break, right? There's just things that you see along the road oh, that just take your eye out. Um, that's why I'm always driving nice and slow. I've been doing that, I've been making an FPV on the dash cam. I have. I think it's closed here at the moment, so I'll leave the car at the top. I think it's a, uh, look at this, what I just saw, man. It was out, out, oh, it's beautiful, man. Beautiful sunshine. Look at this. I just like saw this as I come out of a tunnel, man. And I was like, no way. So I had to, and lucky enough, it's a place you could just stop. Oh, talk about beautiful. Perhaps the owner is here. I just looked down, you see that splash? Look at this. Don't know if it's a trap farm. There's a road just there. And I just looked down and saw this pond full of fish, trout, rainbow trout. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. I can hear that fret. Oh, mate, look, that water. Just bustling. That is alpine fresh water. Man. Well, that might be a selfie. And look where the water is going to. Look at this. I could have wild camped in here. This would have been oh epic. Beautiful. Ah oh, mate. <laughs> that is. Absolutely breathtaking, man. So I thought I'd get out the horse, the cart, and have a quick check of dues. Oh, that ain't a bear, is it? No, this is my concern. <laughs> Are there bears? Oh, man, is that a no? It is. Is that a trout? Yeah, it is. Look, just laying there. There he come. Whoa, how did he get in there through the flood? We've got a mill. Look at this. Oh, milling about. Beautiful. Beautiful. I bet that water, man, and that, is that a that bear? I thought it was a bear. No, it's an owl. Oh, that's all right. That's all right. That is. Wow. What a love. Oh, that's the bear with a fish. Now, that's put me off <laughs> while <Wild> camping. <gasps> the size of that bear. Thankfully, they're not real. But it's put me off Campton. I was going to ask, are there bears in the Alpine forest? And I reckon there must be. <gasps> Bear o'clock, all right, I can tell you. Early. I don't think there's anyone here unless the people stay here. But, oh, mate, look how crystal. Crystal clear. <gasps> Come a dog. Come two dogs. <laughs> Have they been ushered in? Oh, we've got swans. We've got a goose. Hello, okay, okay. Look at him. Whoa. Hello, mate. I ain't got no bread. No. Thank you. Thank you. Ciao, ciao, ciao. ciao. yes. Thank you. Beautiful, man. <sighs> Look at that water. I've never seen water that clear. He, he think he's going to get fed, didn't you, Mr. Swan? Um, I ain't got... Uh, I've got bread in the car. Stale bread from yesterday. So that was what I just wanted to, to stop and have a look at them. Beautiful area. I've never seen so many trout. I ain't got no food, mate. I ain't. Mr. Geese wants feeding as well. That's blown me away. And the river is, is more or less, the water in the river is this turquoisey, turquoisey color, but clouded, man. It must all be fresh from the snow that melts from the peaks of the mountains. But that is, that was so worth, well worth stopping. My first little stop of the day. We get the swan in this thumbnail, look. 
<laughs> Brilliant. Now I've had a little bit of a walk. The size of that trout. A couple of big ones. Whoa. Whoa. I'm really enjoying my day. I really am. It's epic. And I haven't done much climbing, except for now, up in these mountains. There have been a few tunnels that I've gone through, and I kind of, oh my, awesome. So I am making an FPV, first person view, point of view, film of just driving along, listen to James Taylor Quartet, wait a minute. That's my soundtrack for the day. Wicked, could probably, if you if that guy, if you ate there, probably might let you camp there for the night, and then get attacked by a little bear. But that was absolutely, oh, it's a restaurant. Oh man, I bet they serve trout. And there it is, look. I'm only got a tower. It's just, just incredible. Beautiful, man. Right, back on the road. Yes, right. At 10.45, I crossed into the Republic of Ostrich, Austria. It is now 11.30. Oh, hang on, 11.30? Wow, what I had to do last night, my camping, uh, where, where I woke up this morning, it was really damp. That arid air, I had damp all over the tent. My house was damp. It was, and so was my quilt. Where and and where I wiped that window there this morning. This is all a bit dampy, wampy. It is. So when I packed away this morning, I couldn't. I couldn't sit there forever waiting. I'd, I'd still be sat there, wouldn't I? So that's now. I've got the tent. I pulled over. Check the area out that I've just found. I was like, I'm driving off towards Salzburg. And my first stop will probably be Spittle. So I pulled over. I want the tent to get all dried out. I may spend another night in the tent. I love it. I'm loving the world camping. And I could have perhaps camped there. It is a bit busy with the main road there going up too. Um, oh, what's it called there? Uh, it's not the Autostrader. What do you have here where? Ah, oh, the thingy. Anyway, look. I'll think of it in a minute. Of course I will. Look at this. What a wicked little spot. Oh, man, no snakes. Could you sit here in the shade? That water, that's that, that, look at it, man. It's not as clean as the water I have been seeing. And as I look ahead, it still looks misty. So I figured, time out, innit? So, I think. Oh, man. So I've got, got the car as having a rest. It's not good for the car sitting in the sun. It need a bit of shade. But I need that tent box to get fully dried out. Get the air pumping through there. So I'll open that up, a little, all the vents and that, and open it up. So my pillar, pillars are just uh, sitting there in the sun, drying out. My quilt, took my quilt out, because that was a bit damp on the inside. It was toasty on the inside, but on the outside, it's a little bit damp. So I've just slung it there. It's bone dry. So that is going to sit there on both sides for a bit. But look at this. I. Man, them little, I can lay in here, look. Well, that is awesome. Well, it gets a bit deeper, this deeper channel. Man. And actually, wow, fish go there. Fish, is a, there's a shawl of them. Oh, if only I brought a little rod, I could be having fish barbecue. So you can see with this beautiful, it's not crystal, this clear water meets that murky water right there. And there's a huge, I oh, mean, this is wicked, man. This spot is awesome. It is an awesome spot. <laughs> could have wild camp. I could have like could could have wild camped in there. And and the reason I'm what a wild camp again is I love it. I lots of pollen in the air. Look, this alpine trees. I'm not in any rush to get where I'm going. Just want to enjoy the Alps while I'm here. So I'm I'm going to get the cowboy out in a minute. Be rude not to. It would, wouldn't it? Oh look, look at the little stream, little wooden bridge. Just there as that stream is coming, trickling. That is going to be fresh. Oh man, not fresh enough to drink perhaps, but I do need, oh man, some water. Fill up my water bottles um, in case the cart needs uh, some 
some water. It's doing all right at the moment. But I, I've been threatening you guys to show you, I think on the wild camping, uh, my shower unit. So I'm now gonna put it into good use. But how cool is this place? Someone lived there. People lived there, you got a road. Tractor just come round here at a minute, probably off to that massive quarry up there. Of which I expect there's probably more quarries ahead. But the alpine trees, man. Beautiful, man, are they large? Don't know, Woody would know if they're large trees. Just going straight up. Or are they acorns? Are they? Like these, these have got acorns on them. They're all, all about. They are. So the tent box is drying out. I'll just move the car about, get that all vented. I oh, will. So I don't know what that says. <laughs> Hang on, up tongue, baby. Got no idea what that means. <sighs> so the quilt is drying out, that's good news. In that bit of sun. I move that so that get proper dry. I believe, I'm a little bit peckish, so I believe it's time to get the cowboy out <laughs> and do some wild camping here in the Alps. How could I, how could I not? And I can have a bath in there, can't I? He says, this going, this go, it's going to be cold, isn't it? Well, I say that, it's running water, so yeah, it's not going to sit there and get warmed up, is it? No, how cold is it? <gasps> it's frozen. Oh man, that is freezing cold. <laughs> maybe I won't get me shower out. Oh, maybe it will, I don't know, I don't have to. Oh man, what a wicked, wicked little spot. Decisions, decisions, decisions. It's mad how this clean water meets that dirty water. I don't know what that river is. Oh, make me feet are going numb. Ah, oh, they are, won't be going. Ah, oh, my feet are numb. Going in there, don't want to get numbed up. Mate, that's proper cold. Wow. I suppose when I come out, wow, get warmed up. Enjoying this, I really am. The adventure, so I'm enjoying it a lot more. Now I'm heading back. I say, we, I, I liked all the chateaus and everything that I've vlogged about in France. Got to Italy, what did it get out? I can honestly say, that the east side of Italy is much better than the west side. Weren't happy about that. I had dodgy campsites. Well, it was just not that pleasant. Well, when you're driving through Austria, <laughs> uh, through the Alps into, uh, into Germany, I swear I'm heading, I'm heading kind of towards Salzburg and then Salzburg heading to Munich. And if I stick to the old, oh man, if I just find places like this all along the riverside, Oh, it's going to be wicked places, man. Proper. Much better than, uh, than the route to Greece. So I'm actually really enjoying the journey back home through the mountains. I am. It's really cool. It is. I know, it's still a bit damp, so they've got a lot of drying. So I've probably got to sit here for at least an hour. My last time I've got to get out of the cowboy. I've got, here's my shower unit, look, if you're wondering. I've got me wash and go and everything. I thought this have a pro I won't be washing my hair now, I don't want numb head. But I might get out on the go and have a little spray. And that, I've got my towel in there. Get naked in there, can't I? Yeah. Tough life, eh? Wow. Fresh, clean, aired, dried. <laughs> oh, I love that. Wild camping, where is it now? It's only now 12.55, so it's barely there an hour. Everything all dried out. I made a wild camping vlog out of that ice cold shower. Oh, that's why I feel so fresh, I feel so good. And only one little tin of beer. Right, that's me guys. I am out of the little zone, which was awesome. And I am now going to rejoin the highway. <laughs> Spittle, that's where I'm going. Spittle, how could I not remember spittle? <laughs> spittle. Right, and away we go, in the Alps of Austria. <laughs> With me James Taylor Quartet. <laughs> See you later. Whoa. I am stuck in a traffic jam. And I have been since 1.34. 
one thirsty four? I have been. It's now one forty-seven. And I've been sitting and I am one is thirsty four. Hang on, let's have some sizzle. One is thirsty four. A bear. Which have been sat in my ice cold water from the river. So cheers. Oh, liquid refreshment. As I sit here, I turn the engine off. Wow, battery, I'm letting charge off the thing. It's just a trickle charge. I don't think it's going to run the battery flat. Um, battery in the uh, GoPro, the dash cam one. Oh man, what to do? I did think about getting out and sitting in the sun, but if I did that, the traffic would start moving. Look, we are in. There. Hey, all the way there. Not much more I can do. So I'm having a bear break, aren't I? <laughs> there you go, so there's a new one. I, I don't know where that come from. One thirsty for a bear. One is always thirsty for a bear. I know. <laughs> I wonder how many of you are going to use that. That's a new one. We've always had 11 thirsty, 10 thirsty. Now we've got one thirsty for a bear. So, Hopefully, oh, people are now getting back in their cars up there. Uh, so it may be an indication that we're going to move on. But I thought if I drink that beer and feel tired, I reckon I've drunk that in two or three minutes and have a couple of guzzles and I'll just sit here and have a doze, isn't it? Oh, man. Well, it has been an exceptional day. Uh, it's still all right. That's why I'm still not too fussed, really. Having a bit of a break, turned the car off. It's all good. And I've got beer. Chilling in the back. I might get the cowboy up. I'm here much longer. Don't know if I've got anything to cook. I've got no bait. I've got nothing to cook. Or what could I do? I could put the kettle on and make a cup of coffee. It's all right. The motorway is closed, but I've been. It is now four minutes past three. <laughs> the police. That's all closed. So I guess there's an oil tank that I see. It's my. I don't know. It's been a crash, or maybe they're doing roadworks. So they're all now being filtered onto the g mand whatever. Ah! Now I was thinking I was going to have this detour <laughs> to get off that road. Well, there you go. That has been made for me. So I guess I'll now be in a very slow moving traffic on a B road. That is an A road I've just been on. There is the, not Autostrada, Autobahn. That's where you can go like as crazy as you want, I think. I think you have to pay for that. But that is me. I'm now stuck in this little long traffic jam, but at least we're moving nice and slowly. <sighs> just just keeping your guys informed. Alrighty, well there's hordes of traffic being directed in the other direction. I thought time out. I need internet. I need power. Computer's nearly done. Uh I, I need everything, so I am going in, in here, looks like there's a village, oh mate, don't tell me more road works, did I want to go, oh man, is that the road, I want to go in to that village, maybe that's not the way, <laughs> no, I don't stall it mate, well that's not good, I'm going to this village, it looked awesome, this village, this SD card is nearly full. <laughs> oh, but I ain't got enough battery power. G Mund, that's where I am. Let's go into G Mund. Shell, petrol, cup of tea, everything. Let's see if I can get internet free in Shell. And I got a coffee place, I might be able to sit and charge my laptop up for an hour. Because the battery is about to die. Let's go in. But the village looks cool, look. Man, nice ornaments. Nice looking Austrian spa there if I want to go shopping. Nice church, derelict building. Oh, it's all right. It's got something. I'll chill out here for a bit. Oh man, look at that. <laughs> I might drive through there in a minute. Give us a minute. We're going into Shell. I want to see if I can get some internet, man. We're back. I'm going up here, I'm glad I'm going up here. 
uh, six six minutes away from a holiday home that is 25 euros according to booking.com shell has really good internet so i've actually managed to catch up and this is awesome so if i can get i'll do a vlog in here this looks really cool whoa nearly got backed into so here i am right so i could have cheap accommodation in this cool gmond is where i am it looks cool doesn't it can't believe accommodation is going to be 25 euros it's going to be a hostel of some sort but i don't mind if i get a car park i can park up all i want is the electric and to and to catch up as i'm struggling with space man now i now i'm in into the up this is the road that i kind of expected in second gear going into third dropping down a second on these hairpin corridors steps this is what i was expecting all the way oh man and there's oncoming it's not a one-way street it's a narrow two-way street all right where do i go here all right i'll keep on the low road right here <laughs> so we've got a bit of proper alps driving after all as i head off to this precarious looking place that now <laughs> I reckon the reason I oh mate uh, is 25 bucks probably because no one go there this could be the place wow look another hairpin wow <laughs> in a second <sighs> shell what a wicked got internet wow will I get up here in second back into first <laughs> as we go up these steps oh man I don't mind it, but the car, as you can imagine, the car ain't got like this. No, it is not. We're now in the second gear. Oh, man, we've got to take it easy in case there's something coming the other way. Well, you've got to keep your revs and speed up so you don't stall. Wow, the Alps, man. Wow, look at that. Wow. <laughs> Lovely flat meadows. Oh man, this is it. It's like Norfolk with hills, isn't it? I'm loving it. Oh. So this SD card on the first person cam is going to end pretty soon. Revels. Yeah, man. So I haven't booked. I'm going to rack up. Is this the place? No, I've got a bit more to go yet. Nice road. Now in the third gear. <laughs> Taking it easy. I oh, yeah. <laughs> am. We're in the fourth. It's a downhill. Running commentary. Oh man, will we make it to the location? Will we have head on? Whoa. No cyclists coming. No. <laughs> Blind bends, no mirrors. Ah, oh, that is awesome though, look. Beautiful looking apartment. Man, a bit of Austria. Oh, how cool. How cool. Look at this. We're proper in the Alps. Wow. Oh, man. Ah. <laughs> Whoa, up, up, up. Go and get up there, mate. Yeah. <laughs> this is awesome. I don't mind this. Oh, I'm just hoping I'll get my prize I just want power I now check the comments so it's four or five days I haven't been people are starting to get worried as they do but I don't put any vlogs up I used to them frequent so I just just got back to a couple of, of my favorite commenters right so here we are is this the place we're going up there oh we are <laughs> Oh, I don't want to go up there. No, we're not going up there. That's the wrong way. Oh, man, we can slowly go back. It's nothing up the chuff for a change. Oh, it's wonderful, man. It's wonderful. Alpine village. I guess that's the right word. So I must be, literally, I'm here. It says I'm here. <laughs> right. It's part of the horse cart right there. Oh, don't tell me it's a false booking could be where the car is give me a second I'll, I'll investigate false booking nothing there it took me to a dead end just spoke to a lady 
Oh, man. She didn't have a clue. Nowhere like it in the... In this area, up here. The road was a dead end. I've now got to go back. <laughs> I got excited. Still, I know, and the fan's now kicking in. Car don't like this. <laughs> but at least the fan's working. I'll have a steady trek back to Shell because I've now lost the internet. Yeah. Oh man. It won't be about here. Oh, hang on. Park here, that's not a. Is that a restaurant? There's something in on my left. I don't think this is the place. I'll have a little park up and have a little ask. We do have a beverage. Okay. Spoke to that place, it's not a coffee shop, that's, that's a bloke's house. He said there is some kind of accommodation this way, about between one and two kilometers. So I must have drift past something, um, but nothing here at all. So, oh man, that's booking for you. There weren't any pictures of the place, it just says 25, that's what I was drawn to. And it's nowhere there, man. No, it's done me in, it's done me in. I tell you what, the weather here is lovely. It is. Ah, <laughs> so I'm going back to the main town. Ah. Okay, back on the Yes King channel. Tough one this is, because I just did a halfway through doing a vlog. I've been back to the shell. I have got internet. I've got GPS to a new hotel. This one looks more promising. So, um. Yeah, I'll wrap this up. I'll have happy ending when I get to the hotel. And then I'll continue with my dead horse. I want a spa there in case I need to come back and get beer. Okay, this is Kremsberg. Loving the little road. Got the street on me left. It was to me right. It's a truck. Everybody's now caught up. So that's why we're slowed up. But I'm one minute away from my accommodation. Which I'm, I'm quite excited about. <laughs> oh, I am. On this twisty bendy alpine road so enjoyable but I say I don't mind driving 10 kilometers out of town I go road up there which I'll probably be on tomorrow oh cool there's a spa here wicked so I didn't do any shopping in the last village I was like no as soon as I got my GPS location that was me I was off ah oh, so we on oh, no, hang on oh, there is a little spa shop in the petrol station all right, fair enough. There's somewhere there I can eat something. So that's good. Oh, that is good. And that is the A10 to Salzburg. So, oh man, so I'm actually on the right road to where I want to be going now. I don't want this road, I want the next one over this bridge. I think that's this one. Wow. Wow, I'm staying right near the stream. Oh, that would be cool, wouldn't it? I think I am. <laughs> I've arrived, the hotel exists right here. That is <laughs> the A road right up there. And this is this village right here by that wonderful freezing car. Ah, oh, man, I don't know if it is that cold. Beautiful running stream. And my room is that one up there with a window open. Cool. Little bar there. Unfortunately, there's no fridge, but oh man, the sound. Just go and see what the room's like, and then I'll um I'll get the computer working, charging, doing whatever it's doing, and I'll have a little walk in the town. But we do have bikers are welcome. Cold beers, good music. Well, okay. So we're going in. Guest off 56 euros. It was the cheapest. On the on booking.com. And there is a bar. Which could, may, or may not be open. <laughs> wow. Oh, and I need, hang on, the Wi Fi. Then I'm going to borrow that. And when I plugged in, then I'll bring that back. And I can start working. Oh, man, it's cool. It's a little water closet upstairs. It's all open. Look, it's nice. I am on the second floor. Toilets there. 
There is a toilet, there is a communal room. Oh no, it's private. <laughs> is it private or privé? That may be, I don't know. I'll have a look. Little look around. It's all right, isn't it? It's what it is. Oh, I'm just happy. Here's a little room. I did just been up and opened it so I could cram down and grab my camera. Wow. A little chill out area there. So I'm going in here. Oh, have I got my plug adapter I have? So I can get the computer on the go and start charging. We well, have a little bed, which is soft. That'll do me plenty good enough. Oh, and look, I've opened the window. Ah, oh, so I can just hear that. So there is a TV, if I desire to watch a movie, which I may do when I come back. Oh, well, right, let's get the lights turned on, get the computer set up, and go to work. Oh, hopefully I can get a new battery in here, and then I'll go for a little vlog around town. Wicked. Because I don't even, I, don't, I can't remember what the town is called. Wow, I'm liking it. I am. I'm liking the shop, I just did a shop in the spa. Bread rolls? Four. She did have some fresh bread. <laughs> she was holding it in her hands. I was like, wow, oh, it's probably been sat there all day. <sighs> so when I bought four rolls, some salami, <laughs> some salami, some cheese, some <laughs> other cheese. Don't know if they're the same. Don't know if it's full fat or half fat. Don't know, Russian roulette. Also, what else did I buy? Ah, two more of them. Whole lot come at 15. 15.45. Oh man, it's cool. Oh, so I've got work to do. Oh man, I'm gonna drink that beer. Might go and sit outside. There's a lady, there's a lady biker who kept smiling at me. Cause I'm not gonna have a sailor. But I have snuck in the kettle, the coffee. Oh, I've got a few tomatoes there. Look, I brought my milk in. I've got my cooker, just <laughs> so I can probably have a sneaky. I'll get the cooker on in there in the, small, in the morning for me coffee. Oh man, so that is me. Gonna have a proper happy ending. It's a very happy day. I didn't even mind. I tell you how cool. And relaxed I am. When I put the ball on my, my short term memory is gone apart. But I'll tell you how happy I am. I got stuck in traffic just sitting there, turned the engine off for over an hour. I didn't bother me, I was alright. I got my Playboy out. I did. I had to flip through the pages. So I got a beer out of me chiller. That was alright. I didn't mind. Didn't mind at all. Says something. Got me ablutions. Oh man, toilet roll, good, because I need to blow my nose. That's good, not right now. I'm going to turn the camera off. Because right now, I'm going to play Russian roulette. That's it, that's all I've got to do. It's now coming up. So I'm editing this vlog. Vlog I'm editing at the moment. Well, I put it together, that's now. People ask me, what do I use? Off definition, that's that Steinberg program there. That's what I'm using, Ultimate 24. And it's now piecing together, what is it, 50, 56%. So before I went out, it was on nothing. And that's basically going back um, around Lagan and meeting my old friends and a few new friends. And that's really good. I quite like it. And that is, the, that's the computer I use, people say. What do you use? The Asus Viabrook. I never answer any questions on any of my channels in the comments. No, I do not. Because all the answers are in the vlogs. So I'll just give you sometimes a thumbs up or not. So guys, cheers to what has been a really cool day. Now look at the view, look, man. I've got that proper Austrian looking. Oh man. <laughs> that sound of music, look, and the house. I don't look like the Von Trapp house right there. Cool. And I'm, I'm just having a look. I don't know if the female bike goes. I don't know if she's staying. I don't know. <laughs> Cheers. Ah. Today's the 19th, so I've still got plenty of time. 
so I may not head to Salzburg. I might have a little look at the map, because I'm liking Austria a lot. And with what I've done, if I can now get my computer up where I want to, and my hard drive's empty, my SD card's down, my battery's full, if I can now do all that today, by the time I leave tomorrow, I might have three days world camping. I might not love the world camping, I just love the places that I've ended up. It's just been awesome. Money couldn't buy where I've been while camping. They couldn't, not with the views. Watching last night in the vineyard, vineyard, I camped up in the vineyard. I'm just sat in my tent with, with the thing open and all events and that, just watching the sun go down with a bear in my hand. Happy as Larry I was. You can watch that vlog on the other channel. So guys, appreciate you putting up with me running on. Now I could, like I say, get to that point of the day where I just have too many bears and I run on. But with the amount of, I've been making like two or three vlogs a day, Somehow I've got to like, I'll get them in some kind of pipeline so I can get them all. So I just make too many vlogs. I just, I do, just love what I do. So I need to get them organised and in order. Oh, man. But the vlog I'm making right now, that is awesome. Uh, I, I loved being in Lake and it was hard leaving, but now, like I say, I'm on the road having this adventure through Austria. I just don't know what, I'm, that's the best thing about not researching, not looking too much. I saw the hotel, I didn't even look at the pictures. Didn't see where it was, it was just chill, I thought that, that'll do me. And then when I got here, just listen, I'll leave the window all, I'll, I'll probably close it when the mozzies come and then I'll open it, just so I can hear that uh, noise. You can hear it in the background. I love it, wonderful. So hopefully I might be camping somewhere like that tomorrow. So until then, cheers for watching, and au revoir.